Hi there crafty friends. So I'm very excited to have got some lovely little vinyl mandala stickers from my awesome friend Annika. She did these specially for me. And here is the black one. So you can't really see but they are absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to be selling these in a pack of one each of the mandalas. So in other words three stickers. But I wanted to show you how to pick them first because it's not like a normal sticker where you just pull it off and stick it on. You, I've tried that and you actually end up tearing it. So for those of you who are going to be using these stickers, this is the best way. If you don't have a, a Cricut machine, this is the best way to take it off using your craft knife. Okay, and then they call this picking apparently if you've got a cricket or a cutting machine you pick all the pieces out so please make sure you do this before you try and use your sticker otherwise you are going to wreck your stickers okay you take all the little pieces out And it does help to have good light so you can see what you're doing. I'm just going to pick this one for you so you can see all little pieces. So make sure you do this before you use your stickers. Um, obviously store-bought stickers, you know, like your laser cut stickers, they're quite easy to lift up. But the vinyl stickers are not so easy to see. Um, so it's important to to pick your stickers first, all the little cut out parts. Okay, it's quite cathartic doing this. I must admit, I went on to YouTube myself to look at how to uh, remove this. Oh my word. And the tutorials were so long and long-winded. I thought I'll rather do my own tutorial for you instead of sending you a link on how to do it. And then they're like, stick it on the mat. I haven't got a mat. Now what? So I decided to figure it out myself and do a tutorial just for you girls. That is easy because we've all got a craft knife, I'm sure. And it works quite well. Okay. So, you know, if we had to buy these um, already picked, it would cost a lot more because you can see it takes a bit of time to do this. And I'm trying to be as cost effective as possible for my South African girls. And there is your amazing sticker. Don't you think that's lovely? So now you can use it on your project. And just remember to be really careful when you're lifting it up. Depending on how intricate your design is. I'll just show you here what I'm busy with. This is a very intricate mandala. That's a black mandala. Isn't it gorgeous? It's very dainty. So you've got to lift it carefully so you don't tear the actual sticker. So thank you so much to Annika for doing these stickers for us um, as a special request for me. And Tanya from Tanya's Heart will also be selling them. So um, I hope you girls will enjoy it. Take care and I hope this tutorial helped you.